Randall M. Roof doesn't do it for the money. He just loves to take pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Call signs K9RMR. Just got my new antenna from my Kenwood THD74 Alpha. Uh, this is the new antenna. This is the rubber ducky that came with it. As you can see, it's it's thinner, but it's also a lot longer. It's almost effective. Not quite. Well, maybe. Let's see if it's double. It's not quite. Actually, it is about double. So, let's see. Hold on measured here. Well, almost double. It's pretty close to being double the size. But let me tell you what the first thing I really noticed uh, right off the bat. I mean, I just finished making my installation video for this antenna, which was a real short, nice little video. But let me show you something. This, uh, when I turn to the NOAA weather, uh, That's the Indianapolis station. Um, and you'll notice, see, see if you notice that, it's a full line. And before, with this one, the Indianapolis station, which is about 45, 50 miles away, um, you got about 5.5, five, 5.6, five, five, maybe, usually about 5.5 five, five, instead of 5.9. Um, boom, no problem, uh, five by nine, perfect signal, uh, pretty much. Um, the Columbus or Seymour, Columbus, Indiana, Seymour, Indiana repeater is, is number seven, channel seven. You see? And, uh. What I did when I had this one, it would be about five, five, six, five, seven um, signal. And what you could do is uh, you put your hand on it, at least in the other room, put your hand on it, and it would pick up the five by nine, a full 100%. Well, with this, I don't have to sit here and hold it. It's, because it's bigger and a better antenna, it picks up the five by, as you just saw, it picks up the five, the whole signal um, just sitting here. So already just... But uh, listening to the NOAA weather alert, the the two the two stations that I can pick up, um, it's already made improvement. So I'll be curious to see uh, as far as transmitting how much better it is. But already right out right out of the envelope, right out of the sleeve, <laughs> it's um, it's an improvement. Um, I mean I knew it would be, but I just didn't know how much or. And right away, the NOAA weather received it better. Um, so definitely, I mean, this is under twenty. With even with shipping, it was like eight. With shipping, it was eighteen ninety nine. With that's with shipping and tax from e, on eBay. So it was under twenty bucks. That's the import. That's the thing. Then the big number you want. It's under twenty dollars. And already, boom, improvement. So I'm looking forward to seeing what I can do as far as transmit and. You know, I thought the extra length would be annoying, and it, granted, I mean, would I rather have this antenna from the point of, uh, point of view of size? Yeah, of course, because it's, it's obviously, to, I mean, I wish I had a little antenna that was like this big, but the problem with those are they don't, they don't, wouldn't get the quality of this or this, but, you know, I wish the technology was there where I could have just a little itty bitty antenna, or just a little itty bitty antenna, but, with technology being what it is, this is a better antenna and it works better. And like I said, I'm looking forward to seeing all the things it can do as far as improving uh, transmitting and receiving. And like I said, it's already improved in NOAA weather. So I'm just, I'm excited to see the improvements. Like I said, I've already seen some. So i repeat myself. <laughs> That's all I'm in my video there. So until next time, I'm Randall and Ruth saying thanks for watching. Have a good day. May God bless you. 73.